Hello, this is a video about Scratch, and, um, th we are going to try to make a person shooting. So, I've made this script a few times before. So, first, let's change the name into, you know what, I'm just going to do it to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, because it just seems like the right name. And then, we'll make the script which allows you to move. And then, we'll go to the real shooting part. But for now, we're not going to make the shooting. Leave it on Kunde. Anyways, first, that would happen, um, okay. And then now, we'll have to make the scripts that the gun won't move. I just made the, the gun and the sprite separate because, you know... It has to shoot from the gun, not the body of the person. Have you ever seen a person which can shoot a bullet from its body? You haven't, don't you? So now let's put in this script. Okay, it's not in, so... We'll put this, try to put this again. Let's see if it worked. Nope. Try it again. Nope. You know, we're just going to make the script here. As it's not really a complicated script. As you can see, the script works, works pretty well. Yeah. Except for that. You know what, we're going to set this guy to 122. So these guys go go together when they spin. Yeah. What's wrong with this? Oh, I see what's the problem. This guy should be... What? I don't get it. I see what's the problem here. So, now it should work. See? They run in peril. As you can see, this guy's minus 90. We're going to change this guy's to minus 92. So they can work in parallel. And now let's make a bullet. bullet. You know. I mean, there's no use for a gun if there isn't something, if there isn't even a bullet. So this, let's just say that is the bullet. You know what, the color is it right? I'm going to change the color to, um, let's say, um, black. I just like black a lot. So, now we're going to the real screen. So let's say if we press space, we copy the, you know, bullet. So, when it's copied, it goes to the gun. And then, until it touches a wall. So, basically, this is the script. Until it touches a wall. Move it front, let's just say, um, 25, and that's, you know, probably the regular speed for a game. Enter. So, you see what I'm doing here. 
and then put a delete clone. No, I know this will work. Do, do, do. And I um, forgot that these two were. Yeah. So, put on minus enter. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, I forgot one thing. He has to look at the direction of the gun. So where is it? Um, gun? Oh, here you are. Sprite 2 and... Um, as you can see, it says minus 90. So now it should work. See? A lot of bullets. Yes. But a real gun has wait, wait time. So let's say it's, let's make it a machine gun and say it's 0 0.1. And um, we should also add something fun. So since machine guns are inaccurate, we'll add a plus here from one to 10 block, and then change the 1 to a minus 10. So you see what I'm doing here, right? So now, it would, it would be more disaccurate. You know what? Something's not working. So we'll just make it like the regular scripts and do something similar. block if you're not preferring to do it like that and then there's a press space key here and then go back to events and then do this as you can see now even when you spin you can shoot the bullets which is quite a big improvement but what is this bullet doing here so I'll make this guy hide um so now none of the boards are visible, right? So we'll make the you we'll use the block show. Not hide it, and then as you can see, now the real board isn't visible, but the copy boards are. So that's basically the shooting mechanics. But, what if we wanted a more faster shot, or a bit more disaccurate, as it's still completely in the gun. You could change this number. Of course, I'll just share it so you could copy it, like this. So, th basically, this is what happens. And, you know, this is my... My icon, this is my project, and, you know, you could see me, <clears throat> my account, which is very rare, but it's still possible. So, that's it for this video. Next time, we'll maybe try to make gravity in a, you know, like a platformer game. Bye.